Thanks for joining this how-to screencast brought to you by Salesforce Support. In this video, we'll show you how to use enhanced builder landing pages in marketing cloud account engagement. By the end, you'll be able to explain some of the common use cases of landing pages, demonstrate the differences between classic and enhanced builder landing pages, show how to create an enhanced builder landing page, and explain enhanced builder landing page best practices. Let's get started. Let's begin by defining what a landing page is. A landing page is a web page that visitors land on after clicking an ad or a link. Typically, landing pages display content specific to the corresponding ad, search keyword, or clicked link. It's important to note that landing pages hosted in Marketing Cloud Account Engagement are not automatically integrated into your website hierarchy. There are many benefits to using landing pages. Landing pages act as a tool to attract new prospects to your website. They encourage anonymous visitors to convert by presenting compelling content and prompting them to submit their details via a form. This submission triggers the creation of prospect records. Landing pages can be utilized not only for generating sales, but also for informational and promotional purposes. And finally, landing pages enable the automation of follow-up actions and the addition of prospects to a list for targeted outreach. So how can you leverage landing pages? Landing pages can be used for new products or upcoming promotions pages that your marketing team can share across social media and online ads without requiring support from your website development team. You can also incorporate landing pages into your marketing strategy, using content-based campaigns, for instance, or positioning yourself as a thought leader through knowledge-sharing blogs or specialist case studies. You can utilize landing pages to share event logistics and facilitate registrations. You can also use them for presenting curated content that drives visitors towards a call to action, such as filling out a form to download content or registering for an event. And finally, you can leverage landing pages as an effective account-based marketing tactic. Marketing Cloud Account Engagement provides access to several different personalization tools making this process even more seamless. Now let's explore the two types of landing page builders available in Marketing Cloud Account Engagement and highlight some distinctions between them. The classic landing page builder is an HTML and what you see is what you get editor that is available in Account Engagement Classic and the Account Engagement Lightning app. The enhanced landing page builder is a drag and drop editor built on Salesforce that is available in the Account Engagement Lightning app only. It supports list views, actions, reporting, and other Salesforce Lightning experience functionalities. The Classic Builder provides greater flexibility for custom code, allowing you to create landing pages with no code, low code, or full code designs. Layout templates enable quick application and updating of styling across multiple pages, while content regions control editing restrictions. In contrast, the Enhanced Builder creates landing pages through drag-and-drop components. It also offers over 20 built-in style options for more complex code needs, such as adding tracking code using header and footer code blocks, or customizing cookie banners. Landing pages built with the Classic Builder allow responsive behavior customization, while those created with the Enhanced Builder are automatically responsive, allowing you to publish, unpublish, and make changes to live pages. Landing pages built with the Enhanced Builder can also be cloned across business units, and you can use Chatter to collaborate and log changes. It's worth noting that you aren't restricted to using a single builder for all your pages. You can utilize different builders for different scenarios. However, once a page is created, you must stick to the same builder for editing. Switching between builders for edits is not supported. Before diving in, let's review a brief checklist to ensure your Marketing Cloud Account Engagement account and website are technically prepared to support your landing pages. First, create a branded tracker displaying your company's name in the landing page's URL, instead of a generic Marketing Cloud Account Engagement address. This not only enhances the customer experience, but is also essential if you're using first-party tracking. Next, for insights into your prospects' post-landing page activities and their entire journey across your website. Add tracking code to other pages they're likely to visit 
or be redirected to after engaging with your landing page. Collaborate with your webmaster or developer to assist in designing the landing pages and forms or integrating links to these pages into your main website. Lastly, if you plan to include a form on the landing page, ensure that you have fields prepared to capture the values from form submissions. These can be default or custom fields. Also, consider mapping them to Salesforce if you wish to view these values there. As we proceed with creating our landing page, we'll focus on five key areas of the Enhanced Builder. Creating a landing page, adding and styling components, exploring header and footer code blocks, incorporating a Marketing Cloud account engagement form, and finally, publishing and unpublishing the landing page. Let's start by creating a landing page. Open the Account Engagement Lightning app and navigate to the Landing Pages tab. Click New to create a new landing page. Let's give it a name and choose the campaign we want to assign to this landing page. Keep in mind that the campaign you select needs to be a connected campaign. If you're working with multiple account engagement business units, this is how you control which business unit a page and its metrics sync to. Additional options on this screen include the ability to hide the landing page from search engine indexing, adding a vanity URL to customize the text at the end of the page's URL, and including an unpublished redirect. Then, if you unpublish the page in the future, you can send prospects to the redirected page instead of the default page that's in your account settings. Click Save to load the new landing page record. Once loaded, let's click on Edit in Builder and to start the page building process. First, let's take a quick look at the different sections of the builder. Located on the left side, the components section houses standard components such as buttons, HTML, images, forms, and rich text. These are the building blocks of your page. Below that are example layouts you can use to quickly style your page. In the middle is your landing page view. This is where you visualize and build your page. The right-hand side is where you provide details about the page and apply styling. For this demonstration, let's say we're creating a sign-up page for an event. We can add a page description that will be visible in search results, as well as a page title, which will appear in the browser tab. We can also customize the page's background or body with a different color or image. Next, let's drag and drop an image for the page header. You can either copy and paste an image URL or add one stored in your Salesforce CMS. Don't forget to include alt text and a URL if you want the image to be clickable. Styling options for the image are also available. Next, let's incorporate one of the pre-built layouts, then drag over the rich text component to add some descriptive text about the event. Now, let's apply some styling to enhance the visual appeal. In the second column, let's add an account engagement form. The Enhanced Builder has over 20 different styling options, so you can maintain consistency across multiple pages using the same form without altering the master styling. You also have the option to change colors, modify label appearances, and refine button styles. Check out the Implement, Account Engagement. Use Forms session to learn more about creating and styling forms. Now, review your page to make sure you're happy with how it looks on tablet and mobile. It's important to note that you can't customize these views with different components. They just get resized and reordered. Click Save, and now we click on the back arrow to return to the landing page record. If you want to incorporate advanced code, such as Google Analytics tracking or a third-party managed cookie banner, utilize the header and footer code blocks found under the Settings tab. To preview the page, click the Contents tab. Remember if you're using dynamic content, merge fields, or other personalization tools, you must publish and view the public link to view the complete page in action. And when we're happy with the page, click publish to push the page out to your prospects. If you need to make changes after publishing, you can do it by clicking the edit in builder button. However, note that these changes won't appear until you also click publish again. You'll also notice timestamps that indicate when your content was last saved and when it was last published. This information tells you whether changes have been made to your landing page that are yet to go live with your customers. And there you have it. You've successfully created a page using the Enhanced Landing Page Builder. 
Keep these best practices in mind as you create your account engagement landing pages. Be consistent. Ensure that your landing page aligns with the initial value proposition of your link or ad. Keep it simple. Minimize clutter on your landing page so prospects can focus on the most important elements. Design for the eye. Assume that your prospects are likely to scan rather than read your content thoroughly. Use visual indicators to guide them towards the desired actions. Continue the journey. Consider the next steps you want your prospects to take. For instance, can you suggest follow-up actions on the thank you page or implement tracking code and page actions on related pages to keep them engaged? Push to action. Incorporate a clear, persuasive call to action that's immediately visible on the page. This video has highlighted the significance of landing pages in your marketing strategy. The enhanced builder in marketing cloud account engagement simplifies the creation of landing pages and templates, making the process more efficient than ever. For more information, check out these articles on help.salesforce.com or visit us on the trail at trailhead.salesforce.com. Thanks for watching.